Hello everyone. If you've reached the point in the process where you're ready to begin writing, you've accomplished a lot. You've chosen an interesting topic. You've created a dynamic outline. You've searched for information and synthesized the information that you found. Now you're ready to think about writing in the APA style. APA paragraphs have a consistent style. We have three main sections in each one, the topic sentence, the evidence supporting the topic, and the so what statement. The topic sentence is that umbrella statement that is a synthesized explanation of what the paragraph's going to be about. It's followed by the evidence, which is what the experts know about the topic. We have next the so what statement. The so what statement wraps up the paragraph. It gives the explanation of what's important. What's the takeaway for this paragraph? Don't assume that the reader will connect the dots on their own. Now you might wonder about a transition because sometimes you need a transition to move from one paragraph to the next. The transition always comes at the beginning of the paragraph. Your so what statement, your takeaway, is at the end of the paragraph, and the beginning of the following paragraph will include your transition if one is needed. Let's look at an example. We have a topic sentence. It's synthesized. Attendance at supplemental tutoring is correlated with student success. That describes everything that is in this paragraph, and nothing that is in the paragraph doesn't relate back to that topic sentence. Then we have the evidence with citations. There's several pieces of evidence here from the experts. First, students attend optional workshops and score higher on their final papers. And we've got the citations pointing to the sources of that evidence. We also say that in a nationwide study, supplemental tutoring corresponded to increased retention and graduation rates. And we cite that study. And finally, we say that several studies showed supplemental tutoring is among the most influential factors in student success. And here we've cited several studies to go with it. Our last element is that so what statement, that takeaway. Universities should consider expanding and promoting supplemental tutoring options. They'll increase retention, progression, and graduation rates. That is an APA style paragraph. Now you may have questions about the citations or other elements of APA style. I want to direct you here to the APA Citation Guide for the 7th edition. You can find this at libguides.bernal.edu slash APA7. Libguides, L-I-B-G-U-I-D-E-S dot Bernal dot edu slash APA7. This will tell you pretty much anything you've ever wanted to know about APA. For example, what's new in APA 7th? There are changes, so keep that in mind. We have information on in-text citations here. Paraphrasing, for example. When you're paraphrasing or synthesizing examples, it'll give you some ideas of how to cite that information. We also have examples under how do I cite journal articles. Here are examples for all kinds of journal articles. And a reference list and sample paper, all in APA 7th. So this information should be very useful to you. It will help you get your citations right. It will help you know where to insert them and how to do it. And if you have problems with it, 
you can always ask a librarian. Thank you so much.